nine out of every 16 people have a widow's peak. Widow's peak is an autosomal dominant trait. So that means the nine out of every 16 people is dominant. And we always want to start with recessive. So if nine out of 16 are dominant, let's start with 16 minus nine is seven. And those are the number of recessives. So that is our Q squared. So Q squared is seven out of 16. What are the allelic frequencies for widow's peak? So we're talking about the alleles. Find P and Q. Seven out of 16 is zero decimal four, three, seven, five. Then we find Q, which is the square root of Q squared. So zero decimal four, three, seven, five is zero decimal six, six, one, four. And then P is one minus Q which is one minus zero decimal six, six, one, four, which is zero decimal three, three, eight, six. So P and Q, Q value, let's do P first, P is 0 0.34 rounded, and Q is 0 0.66. In a population of 850 people, how many are heterozygous for widow's peak? So we're looking for 2PQ, 2 times, and make sure we use the unrounded numbers. So value for P is 0 0.3386 times Q, which is 0 0.6614. The answer to that is 0 0.4779. And because they asked how many, we'll multiply that by the total number in the population, which is 850. For final answer of 381 people. And we're done.